Throne and Liberty, um, final impressions. Throne and Liberty. I have been um, gaming on Throne and Liberty for a while now, and I, I have around 100 uh, hours. I've done every dungeon, um, hardest difficulty the game has to offer. I've done enhancing, I've done um, enhancing my gear, progression. I've done um, Shadow Crypt, the in-game uh, grind with friends. Um, I've tried to devour the game through and through, so here are my final thoughts. You know, earlier my first impressions review was at a 5.8. Um, the game has successfully managed to um, impress me even further to about a 6.5. So I guess you can stop watching this video review here. If you just want the number, it's a 6.5. I don't think it's going to increase any further um, at all, especially for a person that doesn't want to do PVP, which is a great big part of the game. Um, it's doing PVP, and this is just from a PVE perspective. You can take it as you want, but so far, my takeaways from the game is that it is very limited experience for somebody who wants to do PVE. Unfortunately, I have already kind of feel like eh about the game. I'm already at the point where it's like, do I really want to? Because if I upgrade my gear, I enhance my gear, there really isn't anything that my gear would even matter. You know, you could successfully run all the dungeons with like a party of like six healers and still clear it with bare minimum gear uh, enhancing. So it doesn't really give me that drive to log in and enhance more because I've devoured PBE. It's just done for me as a PBE player. As a PVP player, sure, you might be able to get more out of it. But even then, so I feel like if I did a couple more PVP, the game would still run its course at some point, probably extend the length of the game for me personally um, by an extra maybe month if I included PVP, but I would still run into that point where I'm like, yeah, I don't really care too much about this. The game is very mid. It's at a 6.5. Do I recommend anybody playing this game? Absolutely. 100%. The game is free. Why not give it a try? Monetization um, opinion hasn't changed. I think it's one of the better monetized MMO experiences out there that don't try to sell you like three different... Um, uh, four to five different 30 month deals to get more of this the buying extra inventory blah 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 with currency isn't really an issue they don't have a lot of these inconvenience problems that they later then sell you a solution to which is something that i really really appreciate from throwing liberty that's one of its positives i think um jank is so bad in this game when we're talking about combat jank we're talking about grappling jank we're talking about mechanics jank the rubber banding back and forth holy moly if we're talking about jank the game still needs to be optimized better um with that being said though i still think the game is a 6.5 a solid 6.5 music is great um my this is my final impression um it is 10 months old in korea just about and it's fresh for the west there's still a lot of improvement they can do for an mmo launch i think this is a really solid launch don't look at 6.5 as a negative review it's a very positive review especially in the state of mmos i think it's a really great um first impression um and last impression it's an okay um overall my final thoughts is a throne of liberty is an okay game i don't think you're missing much if you don't play it and i don't think you're getting a lot of it from it if you do play it but if you are a person that has been enjoying your throne of liberty experience and uh you really enjoy it what is your review write it down in the comments below is it a 6.5 are you at a 7 are you an 8 are you a 9 i have friends um who really enjoy throne of liberty or who are like it's a 9 out of 10 for them and that's great um i'm definitely not going to argue people's opinions um, I'm happy that they're enjoying it because that is what video games should be all about is your own personal enjoyment versus anybody else. Like nobody else's opinions should matter. Enjoy the game. Have fun with it. For me, it's at a 6.5. Solid MMO. I can't wait to see what it does in the future. Um, but I don't think I have much juice left for this game, honestly. I think it, my journey is 
at an end or coming to an end. But yeah. So tell me what you guys think down below. See you on the next video. Ah, that's what YouTubers say, right? Yeah. Okay. Bye. Hey, that was pretty solid, right? Damn, champ, one take. Hey, YouTube. Yeah, you. YouTube, you know that the success of this channel relies heavily on you. Viewers like you. By hitting the comment, like, and subscription button, you help me really, 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 really a bunch. More than you ever know. You could even put it on mute and walk away, you know, or lower the volume and walk away. But all the success of this channel relies on you. And I'm very thankful if you hit the comment, like, and subscription button. Also, follow my social medias. Twitter. My Twitter, I put out new art and new stuff. If you want to see more of this... Follow me everywhere, Twitch everywhere, everywhere. I give you my permission, my consent. Go, go. Now, um, hit the follow, comment, like, subscribe, Twitter, Twitch, everything. Uh, yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much for watching.